So, let's take a look at my team here. Yeah, pretty good, huh? Well, I'm going to send Pippi out, and even though this is just asking for disaster, I'm bringing over the Elite Four. Through rigorous training, Pokemon and people can become stronger. I'm weight training with my Pokemon. Devin! We will grind you down with our superior power! <laughs> well, there's a threat if I ever heard one. So, it's Bruno! Yeah, he's like the master of fighting type Pokemon, and I don't know how he's holding that Pokemon, with that Pokeball in his hands, but whatever. So, yeah, I said fighting Pokemon, but he does lead with an Onix. And, hmm, that's why I use Pippi here. I'm gonna use Psychic against it, knowing that it doesn't have particularly high special. I'm going to try to save those blizzards for, uh, for Lance. <laughs> Alright, well now it's time to get serious here. He's using Hitmonchan, and this is a little bit, a little bit dangerous. You know, normal type Pokemon and fighting types don't exactly get along too well. But I think Pippi can do it. Yay! Go Pippi! You're so awesome! Such a wonderful Club Fable. Oh, I wanna hug you. Alright, so... Here's Hitmonlee! Yeah, the other one. Oh no, it's faster than Pippi. This could hurt. This could really hurt. Come on, hang in there, Pippi! Yes! She's so good! Just so good. Man, psychic. But is it enough to take out Hitmonlee? It's enough! Go! Awesome! Well, she is just wrecking Bruno's fighting type base. Ah, oh, and an Onyx. Yeah, he has two Onyxes. Go figure. He's just weird like that. Oh, and my psychical fable's so good. But it's not quite enough! Oh no! Pippi! I need you for my champ! Come on! Yes! You're so weak, Onyx. You're so weak. I'm gonna take a ch I'm not gonna take a chance. You know what? I might have been able to do it with Chai Attack and save that one PP, because I'm trying to think of Agatha coming up next, but I gotta go for it. And I got ethers and stuff, so whatever. So there's that Machamp. Look at that boss! Down in its chest! Such a boss! It hits ho so, so strong, though. So strong. It hits hard. And Karate Chop was enough to knock it out, even though it wasn't even super effective! But whatever, you know what? Like I always say, I've got a Charizard! Ha ha ha! I'm gonna fly! And I'm gonna uh, take that thing out and get revenge on my fallen comrade! Yeah, you'll pay for knocking out Michael Fable! Boom! How do you like that, Bruno? Why? How could I lose? Because I defeated- Freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they are frozen solid. Ha ha ha, are you ready? I am ready. So yeah, she uses ice type Pokemon, but most all of them are part water type as well. In fact, one of them isn't even a, uh, an ice type Pokemon. What a rip. Well, the first Pokemon she uses is Dugong. Dugong, Dugong. And um, yeah, it's water ice type. So I, arr, I missed the submission, darn it. How could that happen to me? It's always a gamble, I tell ya. Um, I didn't know if I wanted to use that or Rock Slide, but I'm gonna go with Submission here. Hopefully the recoil isn't too much. Well, I knocked it out in one- Ow! That hurt! That's a lot of recoil damage! Okay, so, well, one down. Cool. Vortigo. Cloyster. Well, I know a Pokémon that has plenty of experience cracking those shells. Go, Pikachu! Except it's gonna take a thunder in order to take it out, I just know it. So Pikachu's gonna use thunder, take out that cloister, it hits, thankfully, and takes it out in one shot. Awesome. Alright, well now here's the odd call, the slow bro. <laughs> um, yeah, this thing's bulky, so I don't even know if thunder will take it out in one hit. But really, Pikachu's my best shot. Well, it did enough, but not enough to knock it out. And that's pretty good. I think I can take it out with Thunderbolt next turn. And that's like the first time I think I've seen Surf used in this playthrough. That's crazy. Normally I have a water type or something that uses Surf in battle. Weird. Alright, well I took out that dry even slow, bro. It's out of here. Jinx? Jinx? 
Well, I know exactly what to do against that. It's time to let my Charizard out to play. Because this is like the one Pokemon on our team that's Ice-type and isn't part water. Which means Charizard gets to roast it. Yeah! Burn that hair. <laughs> awesome. I love that. Fire Blast. So cool. I knew I made a good choice teaching it to you, Zippy. Okay, and the last Pokemon on our team is Lapras. Lapras! Yeah, that thing. A floating island, sort of. Well, you can ride on it, but... Anyway, it's level 56, and it is beefy. It takes a lot to take that thing out. Now, I'm hoping to use a tag team strategy here. It would have been really nice if Blizzard missed, but whatever. Porkchop did just what I needed him to do, because now I can finish that Lapras off with Thunderbolt. It was all part of my plan. <laughs> Alright, so take that Lapras out, and just like that, Devin defeated Lorelei. How dare you! Well, we've taken down Bruno, so now it's time to take on the third of the Elite Four, Agatha! She uses Ghost-type Pokemon. I'm Agatha of the Elite Four. Oak's taking a lot of interest in you, child. Hmm? That old Duff was once tough and handsome. That was decades ago. Now he just wants to fiddle with his Pokedex. He's wrong. Pokemon are for fighting. Devin, I'll show you how a real trainer fights. Alright, Agatha. The Ghost-type master in the game, although a lot of people think she's Poison-type. Or that's, like, what she represents. But, since the only ghost types in the game were Ghastly, Haunter, and Gengar, um, they're also part poison, so it's easy to see why. Oh yeah, so she starts with a level 56 Gengar, and this thing really got the jump on me by confusing me with Confuse Ray right off the bat. What a jerk! That jerk! Okay, whatever, so I'm gonna have to deal with that, and I'll switch out for Zippy to see what he can do. Mega Drain. Mega Drain? Ah, you were trying to get crafty, weren't you? That's right! I can use an Earthquake! Oh, man, this is awesome! That's right, because it didn't have Levitate until Generation 3! Sweet! I can just Earthquake it, show it who's boss. Oh, so good. No wonder it had Mega Train. <laughs> Alright, so, she wants to send out a Golbat against me, huh? Well, I've got just the thing for that. Go, Pikachu! Again, I think it's going to take Thunder in order to take it out, and lucky me, look at that, I actually managed to hit. Again, I haven't missed with Thunder in a while, but wow! What? What did she just do? She just withdrew! I can't believe it. Well, now what do I do? Wow, that was a twist. She just withdrew her Pokemon, I can't believe it. Oh, no! <laughs> Hypnosis? Huh. Well, you know what, I've got just the thing for that. Stop! Poke flute time. Ugh, all sleepy Pokemon woke up. Oh, you were trying to you were trying to be nasty, Haunter. You were trying to confuse me and put me to sleep. You can't lick this Clefable! You can't lick this Clefable! Trust me, other ghosts have tried and they failed just as bad as you did. Oh, critical hit, psychic boom, that thing is gone. Pippi gains a level. Level 55. Awesome. Golbat. Oh, Golbat, you're back, huh? Alright, Pikachu, go ahead and finish what you started. Take that thing out. Get him, Pikachu! Yeah, Thunderbolt. Yeah, Thunderbolt! Boom. Awesome! Okay, so that Golbat's gone, and Pikachu gains a level as well. Sweet! So, she has two more Pokemon left on her team. One of them's an Arbok, which, again, is not a ghost Pokemon, but since there's only three, and she'd really be laughable if she only had, uh, Ghastly. I mean, come on, Ghastly if you're an Elite Four? I don't think so. So, she added a few. Big deal. Arbok. Poison type. Earthquake. Arr, not quite enough to take it out. That's a powerful snake. It is. Darn thing. Oh, well. Earthquake makes short work of it. I mean, she's a super potion. Really? Why would you use a super potion? That's pretty weak. Like, really? Really? 
Gengar. Gengar, yeah! Dream Eater? Dude, I'm not even asleep! What are you thinking? Thanks for just giving me that turn! Haha! <laughs> Earthquake! Critical hit! Oh, it's so good at this game! Zippy, you're a monster! I'm so glad I put Earthquake on you! <laughs> Woohoo! You're something special, child! take on the final member of the Elite Four. That's right, there's only one more of the Elite Four we have to take out! Can my team do it? Well, we're gonna find out. I heard about you, Devin. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance, the Dragon Trainer. You know the dragons are mythical Pokémon. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible. Well, are you ready to lose? Your League Challenge ends with me, Devin. Lance! The final of the Elite Four. Just standing there with his cape. Yeah, so he leads with a Gyarados, level 58. Thankfully, he doesn't have Intimidate. <laughs> um, but this thing is a beast. It's very powerful. It is a water type, but it will hit very hard with its other attacks, too. Thunderbolt, though being quad effective against it, that's right, it's water flying, so it does four times as much damage. It still wasn't enough to knock it out, so I'm going to have to give it a dose of thunder just to put it in its place, and miraculously, Pikachu's able to hit with thunder. So awesome. I still can't believe Pikachu's had such a great track record with that. Now, I know Pippi has Blizzard, and I'm just contemplating if I want to have Pippi out there right away, because it's his Dragonite I'm most concerned about. The Dragonairs are a pain, but I think Porkchop can take him out. Ah. Uh, Submission it has so much recoil damage. I'm gonna try Dig because I'm thinking it's going to take two hits to knock it out anyway. And I was right. No, oh, Hyper. Ew. That's a little disgusting. Oh, come on, hang in there. All right, yeah, no problem there. Hmm, but I can take this opportunity to do something. So you know what? I'm gonna use an X Attack right now since I've already proven I'm faster than that Dragonair. And I know I can knock it out mm -hmm. this upcoming turn. So let's dig. And I use the X attack, so hopefully I'll do more damage against whatever Pokemon he sends out next. Dragonair. Yeah, another Dragonair. Thank goodness. I wouldn't have been quite as happy if he sent out his Aerodactyl. All right, Porkchop, go for it, buddy. Use submission. Yeah, one hit. Now that's smart. Awesome. Okay, so taking that Dragonair out, now he has an Aerodactyl. Oh, it's not a dragon, it's rock flying, and I'm a little nervous. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's why I'm nervous. That thing can fly, just like my Charizard. Uh, there's really no one I can switch to that's going to make this any better. And since the Aerodactyl's faster than me, I can't even, like, dig or something just to get away. Uh... Man, this is not good. Okay, Pikachu, you're just gonna have to try do it. Come on. All right, cool. So it hit fairly hard, but I think I can do. It. Oh, this isn't good. Pikachu, hang in there, buddy. Come on, you can do it. I really need you. No, Pikachu, no. Didn't deserve it. Oh well. I've got Pippi here, and she can finish it off with Blizzard. What is this nonsense? You just use Hyper Beam, you fool! You fool! Well, in Generation 1, if you knocked out a Pokemon with Hyper Beam, you didn't have to recharge. How sick is that? Oh! No! Not enough! <laughs> 